Last week I had a great opportunity to stop by and visit Alice Paulzine. She's 94 years old and when I was just a little kid, she was my Sunday school teacher in a small country church called Grover Community Church. And she has been praying for us ever since I was 12 years old. No more tears in the eyes. All is peace forever. Julie and I got an opportunity to sit down and talk with her, and I asked her this question. So prayer gets sweeter as the days go by. I, I, I just know God answers prayer. Alice can't see very well any longer. She only has about 3% of hearing in one of her ears. And yet, all day long, she asks people for their prayer requests at the nursing home. She prays for us. She says, during the day, she sings some of her favorite songs. On a day that will be when my Jesus I shall see, and I look upon his face, the one who saved me by his grace. Then he'll take me by the hand and lead me to our heavenly home. What a day, glorious day. There'll be no... Be. You know, as we do our ministry at On the Red Box and as we're doing itineration these next few months, you wonder, how is it going so well for us? And then you meet people like Alice and you know that she spends her life in intercession. Of course, we had her pray for us, and this is a short prayer that she said for us. It's not all of it, but just a clip of it, so you can get an appreciation for a woman of God who spends her life close to Jesus and praying for missionaries and for places that she's never been. And shake and that's reach of them. Oh, Lord. It is answered to prayer and everything that has come along. His mouth, his health, his sisters. When I look and now we thank you for his face. Surely. The one who saved me by his grace. And when he takes me by the hand and leads me through. day, glorious day that will be